All right, so there's a clip in there that's titled um, <clears throat> The Full Breakdown. I think it's somewhere near the top. But long story short, let's jump into it. It's been five weeks, five months, roughly, four or five months. Since, We've been doing this for five months. Yeah, pretty much just since the whole collapse happened. And uh, pretty much at this point, they've avoided Adam-22 and what everybody left, essentially, which is Fig Munity World. They've kind of avoided direct conflict. When they first fell apart, of course, there was like little subliminal shots getting taken, you know, you know, you know, whatever, right? But they've they've avoided direct beef. They are at this point are fully beefing now. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Adam's jumping on the bootleg Kev show, uh, telling them he don't want to go. They don't want war. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a lot of things. This video. How long is <coughs> this video? Uh, this video is while they were on the channel. Sorry, this thing is in the way. Uh, two minutes and 59 seconds. Three we'll watch this because I think was, this is gonna like kind of play it all out. But uh, yeah, it's let's just let's just watch a quick recap of the the last week. I'd say last week and a half of just like them throwing shots legit back and forth to each other. You Seven know day saying? synapses. Yeah, yeah. We were never mistreated while they were on the channel. I was always transparent about pay. I was always like very, uh, you know, open to having discussions about what the future of the channel was going to be. So that that is the one thing that really bothers me is just this bullshit right. victim narrative that was painted on the way out. But I don't think the people are falling for it anymore. I, you know, the channel's doing way, way better. We're crushing it right now, um, and I have tons more. Yeah, we're not doing none of that back and forth shit. Y'all doing back and forth. Y'all going to keep making that content. That's what y'all doing. But you need to let motherfuckers know that's watching. Because when I got my peoples, my homies, my little homies calling in, saying, what's up with Cub? It's like, hold on. I don't even know what type of time hey, my he wants this too. to be. We all know what time like it I'm is. saying, I don't know what type of time you want this to be. The time is on whatever time niggas want to be on. I ain't got nothing, I ain't got nothing else to no, say. No, 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 no. <laughs> let's, let's suggest we're like at a nice restaurant in the valley. Are we like cherry beat it out in the nice restaurant? Tables and chairs getting flipped. <laughs> it's gonna look like a WWE match in that motherfucker. Great question though, uh, Duno. Oh, Duno. <laughs> I'm willing to take it wherever, wherever I go. Cause he got two new crips around him, they gonna keep him safe. Like that's impossible, cuz. Them niggas not with you every day. Can't nobody keep nobody safe. Can't nobody keep nobody safe, man. Yeah, nigga, like, somebody know where you stay at, nigga. Don't think you out here moving around scot free. Just cause you be inside the house. It's always somebody that know where you stay at. Always. Yeah. Or like, we don't, uh, homies we don't been, talk. You been wait. Yeah, I feel it. No, don't, don't say all that. Don't say all that. Don't say all that. Don't, 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 don't do that. Unless these niggas won't smoke, it's green light. Nigga, and I ain't talking kind. Sound goofy. Okay, hip hop. you really think that I'm... What did you say? Hip hop. Um, it's green light. Some homies want the green light. Yeah, so it's all the started... Go ahead. When Adam-22 was at yeah. Bootleg Kev show. Yeah. And pretty much Bootleg Kev was asking all the right questions about, you know, the state of their relationships. Are mm-hmm. we cool? Blah, blah, blah. He was on his Gail King. He was like, he was yeah. going crazy, kind of, you know? And he was like, Adam made a couple statements where he was pretty much saying, like, Bootleg Kev said, you have to agree that they are probably making more money now that they're not employees under your network being on their own. Adam was like, hell no, there's no which, way. Which is like... Uh, the biggest setup ever because Blue right. Lake Kevs know that like they're not getting paid as much. They are. They're getting paid more. They're getting sure. paid more? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. How yeah. they getting paid more? They own because, 100% of what they're doing. Yeah, exactly. There's no split. But Well, there is splits, but they're, the splits are different. You know, they're not on a salary. Mm-hmm. They're on a percentage thing, kind of. You know what I'm saying? So you're always going to get paid more when you're splitting a percentage compared to a salary. So they're definitely getting paid more, but... Adam don't want to hear none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? Long story short, on that joint, he was wolfing and barking. He pretty much said, look, man, they can't even get a million views without having... They can't get a million views. They can't talk about without putting me in the title. And then he put a challenge out to them. He was like, look, if y'all can get a million views without talking about me, then I'll know that y'all have learned and y'all have officially left the nest. But until mm-hmm. then, y'all ain't done shit. Yeah. Y'all just niggas out there doing YouTube content. He said, let me see you spread your wings. Yeah, pretty much. That's, that's, real quick. Mad, that's yeah. pretty much what he said. It's and like when he, the kid at the court asked you if you can dunk. Yeah, yeah, and it was just like, he was trying to make points during it how the YouTube's doing better than it ever has been doing. Is Adam still getting a million views himself? Not on individual pieces of content. <laughs> exactly, Fuck no. no. So what and, this is, and this is another thing, too, like, Bootleg Kev even called him out on it. He's like, okay, bro, slow down. You're talking about a YouTube channel that's been going for eight years. Their YouTube channel is not even at a year yet. They can't, you can't 
put those views next to each other right. because YouTube has back catalog. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's not like, even comparable. Because I remember even before they even like had the whole collapse, they were talking. He, Adam was talking about how like the catalog by itself, all the old content can get anywhere from a quarter of a million to a half a million views a month or a million or something. Right, right, a million right. or two. No, maybe it was like two million views a month or something like that. So it's like without trying, you're already getting two mil just because the channel is. 5,000 videos deep, eight years long. Excuse you know what, what you did back in the day. Right. Yeah. right. It's like you planted the seeds. And people yeah. are still clicking on that. Yeah, and people are always going to go back, you know? Mm -hmm. There's an XXX Tentacion interview. There's Lil Yachty interviews. Like, it's so many people have been associated with it that are going to find their way. So, like... That's part of Vlad's whole strategy. Because things become relevant again. So now you do the flashback. Exactly. Yeah. Exa and then Vlad is doing... <gasps> Vlad is eating off it twice because he's uploading it as a flashback. Yeah, that nigga and, extra grimy. Yeah, and he has the original, I'm which I ain't mad at it. I ain't mad. Yeah, if I had somebody up the same piece of content, if I had somebody managing our content, shit, we'd be the same way. Goddamn uh -huh. it, you know what I'm saying? Goddamn flashbacks immediately. So, oh yeah, but yeah, it's just funny because like Adam is out here like wolfing and barking, but I just think like one of the biggest things. I think before Adam went to bootleg calf. I think what he's battling for real is just the fact that he let his wife get piped out. I think it's yeah. all coming to yeah. a head right now. I think, I think he's under the influence of something. I wouldn't be surprised if it's a, if that if he's on that powder again. He's already admitted to like popping a perk or some shit at, during the Jason during the Jason Lee interview with Lena. Lena was like, "What the fuck, nigga? You're, you're on perks again? Like, you know what I'm saying?" Mm -hmm. So it's like, I just think him gassing up. And even if he did have the best month he ever had, it's because you sacrificed everything yeah, in that month. Yeah. You can have a good month. That yeah. doesn't mean nothing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you can have one good month, but is your channel growing? Is it actually, Flourishing. is it is it actual content that people are like, oh, I, I'm fa I found a home here. Yeah. You know what but, I'm saying? I mean, do you have to do something as extreme as letting somebody smash your bitch and then for go, you to have a good month? Exactly. What does it take? Exactly. <clears throat> so that's how he's operating. But he's yeah. going on bootleg Kev with analytics from the month before, talking about, man, we're doing better than ever. Obviously, you're you are you've sacrificed everything. Yeah. You sacrificed your family. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You threw the house up, man. Yeah. yeah so, you did something fucking extreme. You know what I'm saying? Of course the numbers <clears throat> look good this month when mm -hmm. you're having a big month. We had a big month that month that uh the, th the shit went the crazy. Fuck, the um the real. The reel went crazy, and then I got pulled over. We yeah. dropped that video. That went, went crazy. crazy. Yeah. Oh, we, had yeah. a, we had a good month then, too. Mm -hmm. The and, views and, were up. And, you know what I'm saying? And at the actual collapse of No Jumper, Fig Munity and Community, those shits was going crazy because it was brand new. And it was oh, up, yeah. It's off like, of yeah. all of that. Everybody so. can have a good month. Yeah. It's all about where you maintain and you're leveling out at. You know what I'm saying? You go to I'm the just, gym, you're going to get a good pump in there, but that's not what you really look like all the time. Exactly, bro. I'm about yeah. to say. And I'm just I'm confused as to like who said something first. He did. Adam. Adam. Because he's already gassed up. So I guess that's where we really should have started. He's coming off of, mind you, this whole time, pun, community, they've been making, pun has been consistently taking shots since they left. Yeah. So it's like Adam, at the same time, if we're putting some respect on Adam's name, he hasn't been poking the bear. But yeah. in the midst of me burning my house down, now I'm striking back. He has time for this now. I have time for this now. Yeah. Mm. So it's all right. He really was being respectful, I would say, in terms of like since they left and not just gone online to try to crash out on them. Yeah. He hasn't. This is his first time really and jumping out the window on them. And, that's, and a part of it is that, well, nah, they broke up with him. Yeah, they did. They did. And usually that person is going to be the bitter one. That's true. The one that broke up. So it, I, I see how it's respectful. Yeah. 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 Yeah, he's yeah, a little, nor normally he's admirable. That, normally that party would be the one that talks the most shit. He's just been minding his business, which I do respect. I wonder why pun... This is really pun and Adam, is it? It's like... Because pun, pun, yeah. I, pun is 80s manager. Yeah, yeah, ace boys. So I feel like we need a history lesson on like how far them niggas go back. Like How close is AD and pun? How involved? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I know for a, I know a long close time. Close enough to where... <laughs> Pun talking shit in the AD, like I'm on whatever type of time he wanted to be. Pretty on. much. Which is kind of, it's a, it's not a white flag stance. Yeah. But it's uh it's in the middle. Yeah. It's a great You're flag. Different. You're definitely indifferent. You know what I mean? Like, it's almost like you like all the options, so you don't really care what happens. Yeah. Like, you're just accepting of the options, but you really want peace. Yeah. Right, right, right. Because right. if you really wanted that, 
My nigga, you're yeah. a gang member. But yeah. Like, yeah, right, I was gonna say, yeah. is any of that gonna be based on the lifestyle he lives anyway? It's like I kind of have to do this regardless. But he's also a different man now. He's uh he's officially a podcaster. Yeah, he's, he's a broadcaster. Not. He talks on mics for yeah, a living. Yeah, but yeah, he's that still was the new art for right? all of them. What? You said that was new for what? Uh, no, I'm saying, but if uh, if you're talking about pun and pun is finna crash out or whatever, then <laughs> we're gonna like, have what's, plenty what's gonna to do? say about pun. I'm going in on pun, pun this episode. Pun is a big sloppy motherfucker. He's nasty, nigga. You yeah, know what I'm saying? yeah. Just Where's the like, sloth? Just, he's what type of animal is? Who's he? sloppier? Oh, okay. Well, no, no, no. I could. I can't even put them in it. I got to put respect on Big Sloth because he could podcast a hundred times better than than Big than, Surely, than yeah, pun. Surely. You know what I'm saying? But in so, terms of the politicking. In terms of the well, politicking, in terms of the politicking, because I'm gonna have to say Loon. Man. Yeah, you gotta go yeah, Loon. Yeah, I gotta Loon go Loon. Still. Loon I gotta go way, Loon. Still. Loon, yeah. Loon did it in a year. He talked himself into a position. Yeah, big pun still in the corner of his fucking friend's house. And plus, you know, I yeah, like what a uh, fucking lamp and yeah. neck shining at his face. You He's know, what spooky saying? in the shadows. Yeah. And plus, you know, I like the uh, quiet assassin approach. You know, send some bots over. You know. You know, <laughs> right, right. you know, it's like a, ten niggas with ten little knives. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's not loud, True. but it's very dangerous, nigga. Mm-hmm. It is, it but is. you're not getting your hands dirty. You're not even touching. You we me. really only caught. <laughs> we really only caught Big Sloth. Really let his emotions get to him when he had the whole teeth on the ground. And that's why I was saying the sloppiness yeah. is. That was so. Yeah, yeah. Th- because these niggas. Sloth both- is only taking one L in terms of real. Real genuine sloppiness in terms of just internet culture. He's taking several L's by like sending bots and things right, like that. Right, right. But like genuine, you fucked up by doing that. Right. One time. So making it violent, which Adam talked about, is an immediate L. Off the All every right. time. Off the every, right. Anytime you're dealing which, with online content, it's always an L when you take which, the, the violence to the internet. First. Yeah. When you do with intellectualism, if you result to fucking somebody up, you yes. lost. You lost. That every means you time. couldn't it, add up. It is yep. a, a pirate's code when it comes to this shit. Like yeah. you know, it's just certain rules and things that we all just it, we just know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? And it's um. It reeks of desperation. Yeah. And it's like on some man shit too. You know what I'm saying? Like you know, like. All men, like, uh, this is shit that, like, red pill people will say. Like, men have a g- a general level of respect for each other because at the end of the day, we know we can throw hands with shit each other. can go there. <laughs> you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, uh, I'm only going to go there with you if I want to go there. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. So or if that's my last option. option I have right, nothing right, right. Exactly. You yeah. already right. beat me with your words. Yeah, yeah. So, so now I have to retaliate. So in terms of, like, even, even while AD was there, Pun was already out of pocket talking just crazy sublim- side shots at Adam and then since they've really gone and fully separated, it's always pun is always pun, like, pun it's is always the, that gangster shit. Yeah, you know what I'm pun saying? is the type of nigga, he would be hyping up Tupac. He would get Tupac shot. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. He's that one yeah. nigga who's always hyping up, you know. He's Tupac's conscience. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, the spirit animal. The so thug yeah. in him. So for Adam, you know, Adam went on there and for this to be his first Real moment of taking crazy shots at somebody, I would say it was 50 50. He did 50 50 good. I would say, uh, I would say that what's the name? What's the nigga's name? Bootleg Kev asked the right questions. His answers were fucking stupid. You know what I'm saying? Certain questions in terms of just like, we're still doing more views than them a month, obviously. Like, you can't compare two channels that one channel is less than right. a year, the other one's eight years. It's like, <clears throat> so, he says stupid shit, certain things, but there were some things that he did say. That were just like completely when I was like, oh yeah, yeah. Like he's fully crashing out. Like I just mm-hmm. got done with the wife thing. That thing has fully died down. Now let me t- so he was talk let's talk money. You know what I'm saying? He's like, I got way more money than all these fools and all this other shit. That's what he's saying on uh bootleg Kev. And then he also said, uh, to need war, you need to go to war, you need money. And I got a lot of it, so we can go to war. Oh, that's Jesus. So oh, yeah, that's what that. Adam said. just watch Scarface. That's right, what Adam right. said. Yeah. yeah. So it's like that was when it was like that's when when he when I heard him say that I was like this is drugs. He did a line this out of drugs. Lena's <laughs> yeah, this is drugs. Like that's when I was just like this it's is not drug. just and the drugs. And this is allegedly still, you know. Right, right, right. But it's a little but bit of it's drugs, ego, it's everything. It's, you know, right, it's, right, it's, right. it's the situation. <laughs> it's the yeah, situation. Yeah, 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 like, this yeah. is a man at war, literally. Yeah. Yes. Like, with, he's with at himself. war with the, himself, the public, his former yes. fucking yeah. um, yeah. his wife, his wife, his employee, yeah, his health, his like everything, like black penis. Yeah. He's at war, nigga. Yeah, yeah, right that's now. his one ally. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, but it Adam, is crazy, though. Adam is in a position to where it's like 
he is kamikaze in his way out of here. You know what I'm it's saying? It's like his his piece is controversy because controversy brings him like spikes in fucking a viewership. You know what I'm saying? If I'm gonna like, be yeah, if I'm gonna be to. clinically depressed, yeah, about the position that my life is in and the way the trajectory of just like. I didn't expect things to go this direction. Yeah. I might as well make as much money much as I as can, I, yep. no matter how crazy I look, because I don't think mentally he's all there. You know nah, what I'm saying? I, I, do, think, I do not genuinely I, believe that. And what else does he have? What else does he have to offer that's entertaining? Man, nothing. Love talk. Point yeah, nothing. He, no, I'm just talking about in terms of like him. content and messaging. Just, what oh, he could possibly him. be doing and saying. He because he's never been the funniest person on camera. Nope. He's never been the most charismatic. Like, mm. it's some niggas, they don't even necessarily make you mad and well, laugh, but they're just interesting to hear. Well, he, Tony. He doesn't have a knowledge set to where he can just, he can teach you about marine say, wildlife well, no, and, and make I, it cool. That, and you're, you're right. And now. what I would say is that what he did have to offer, his public perception keeps that skill away. So I would say in terms of conversationally, he is good to watch him have a conversation. Like, his interviews were good. Interviews were good. You know what I'm saying? The back and forth. He can just have a good conversation with people. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Whether And that's outside of him trying to drill them for uh, gang, gang, beef. gang questions he and questions, stuff like that. And we're talking about just like a good back and forth because he has so much life history. He's been, he's been a hoe. He's been a business owner that's crashed and failed. He was in the bodybuilding at one point. So, like, I've seen him talk to all sectors of people and have great dialogue. But... When people view you a certain way and it keeps getting worse, no, we can't even. Who we wants can't to even, sit down and talk to you? Who wants to sit down and talk to you? We can't even see the one thing that you are genuinely pretty, pretty good at. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, mm-hmm. perception is everything, and he's survived death. You feel yeah. me? Yeah. And you know when you what is when you're death? an asshole, you know it's like just uh, overall hate. You know, okay. death of the company. Whatever. I would say, mm-hmm. I would say. Oops, I thought you meant that black penis the winner is girl. I would say white shit, banished the black death. woman. <laughs> I would but, say, I would say white exile. The white people ain't fucking with him no more. But it's when you when you've done a lot of you know quote unquote bad things and you survive death, yeah, you come out the other side. You know, a different feeling person. like nigga, I beat Lucifer. Like, how yeah, are you yeah, not? Yeah, what can yeah. you tell me? You broke. True. Fuck true. Yeah, yeah. yeah mm-hmm. True. True. Shoulder shrug the nigga. Yeah. So that's the that's the energy that he's on. You know what I'm saying? So um. Yeah, so I you know, I don't know it's, about it's drugs. Inter- it's interesting. I'm trying to figure out what direction to go in next. You know what I'm saying? Are we gonna play this? We can finish playing this, but this this is already broken into like different segments, yeah. you know what I'm saying? 